Hello guys, uh, welcome, welcome, and today I am going to show you a, a bit of a mystery, actually a few of them, because as you can see right now, you are looking at the map 84, okay, and let's start from the first mystery, okay, and the first mystery is, if you look at the small map, and then you look in to the left hand corner in the top you will see something right now some of you can say that this is a very poorly photoshop job right and i would agree but there is a but there is always a but but if that is a poorly made photoshop job well what if I then click on that tree, that little tree, and if I click on that tree, the little sign of MTP magically start moving. Well, let's give it a go, shall we? And here we go. How come? those little pixels start moving i don't know i just cannot possibly find the logical answer of this beautiful beautifully made photoshopped sign of mtp is actually moving maybe it's a gif maybe it's a superman or, or maybe uh, maybe it's just illusion maybe you don't actually see anything moving or maybe you see things moving but the things aren't there maybe you are actually mental or maybe just maybe i brought up not one but more than one a little tiny F-18 to have fun with enemy troops. Maybe that is the answer, but I don't know. Well, the mystery number two is... How come I managed to get so many F-18s on the map? where I have not a single base. How is that possible? What? Well, stay till the end and you will find out. There is a secret of how to do it. How to bring the bunch of F-18s on the map to kill all the troops protecting the highways and it's a secret which will be revealed at the end and i can guarantee you everyone can do it and it's actually easier than you think okay well let's finish this crappy speech and let's move into some proper work now this work is obviously cleaning up the bunch of troops protecting the highways and we will clean up all of them, all highways. But before I start, I want you to notice the way I'm doing this, okay? So when you have a bunch of planes and whether they're F-18s or any other planes or bunch of, of helicopters, you have to actually target the group you want to shoot at. Because if you leave the planes or helicopters just on their own, once they finish shooting or destroying the group you, you targeted, they will start shooting randomly into the random troops. And you don't want that because if you are with the planes and you are fighting against anti-air units you want to make sure 
you get rid of the anti-air units first and as quickly as possible. So as you will see, I'm targeting the first group, that once this is gone, I'm targeting another group of anti-air units until the groups are gone. And only then, when I got rid of all the anti-air units, I'm enjoying destroying the rest of the troops. You know, just to do the cleanup, right? Because that's why I'm there, right? I, we just need to get rid of all these red dots on the map, right? So that's what we'll do. And then we'll move to the next one, and the next one, and the next one. So pay attention how I'm doing this, and see how little planes I've actually lost compared to what sort of troops I was up against. And there was a lot of troops I've actually taken down. Enjoy! Enjoy!
okay? And now, as promised, I'm gonna reveal the secret how to bring a bunch of F-18s on the map where you have absolutely no bases and then destroy all enemies' troops protecting the highways. Now to destroy the troops protecting the highways you need a bunch of F-18s and that's gonna be relatively easy to do. But obviously you want to know how to have so much F-18s on the map without a base. And the answer for it and the recipe of that, that tiny little detail you will need in order to do this magical performance slash whatever is to go to the particular map take bunch of bases and I mean like probably well hundred maybe Build the planes and then let those bases go. Let the enemy take those bases. And if the enemy at some point stop attacking you, you just need to go back to that map and then tease them a little bit. So on that particular map, I had to go back probably like, you know, five times. And I had to actually take more bases so these guys realized that, you know, I'm about to take over. So they, you know, put themselves together and they took them all. Well, this is exactly what I wanted. Not only I wanted to get rid of the bases so I can do this video, but also I just want to move to the other maps and I would like to have those recoveries, especially on level 12 flux. So this is it, very simple. All you need is a bunch of bases, spend shitloads of gold and uh, let them be destroyed. And then you can have fun like I just did. Now, there is a one aspect of the satisfaction which unfortunately I cannot see. But although I cannot see what happened with the enemy, I can guarantee you the chat, the alley chat, is red hot. And I mean like proper red hot. There were questions like, what the fuck? How come? How come he managed to destroy all our troops? With what? He has no bases. Well, you better check the bases. Maybe we missed something. Well, yes, you missed the bloody planes. You've destroyed all the bases, but you did not check for this tiny little minor minor, tiny and minor detail that I have parked my planes on your map without the bases and I was waiting and waiting and waiting until the point that you beautifully set up all your troops just for my pleasure of destroying them all. All right. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. You have to subscribe so I can get more revenue, so I can do more giveaways, and we can have more fun. Again, thank you very much, and I will see you in the next one.